We're told to always carry bear spray, but what happens when you forget it, can't travel with it, or don't want to spend large amounts of money to purchase it? Well, this is an easy way to rent bear spray before you're heading out into bear country. There are a lot of outdoor enthusiasts here in Yellowstone National Park, but you won't meet anyone more passionate about bear really spray quickly need to get it out of its holster. than Ryan Harbach. Yeah. It's really important that people carry bear spray and unfortunately a lot of people don't carry bear spray. Harbach grew up in Gardner and later worked for Park Service. When I was working for the Park Service I just noticed that there was a lot of bear spray being thrown away or recycled. That observation ultimately led to this. Trail Quipped, Montana's first ever bear spray rental kiosk business. We're in our third year now um, renting bear spray. We're in Gardner, West Yellowstone and at Montana Grizzly Encounter just east of Bozeman. A bear spray canister here starts at $16. It's great for tourists, especially those that are flying in because you can't take it on a plane. There was a study done by the Park Service some years ago that only 13% of day hikers carry bear spray and uh, we would really like to see that number up. Each canister returned is thoroughly checked before being offered for rent again. If someone does use the bear spray, they are charged the full price of $60. Aside from Alaska, Montana has the largest grizzly bear population in the U.S. Most hang out at the national parks, places Harbach knows draws in many tourists. Bear encounters, if you will, have happened in some of the park's busiest areas. So a few years ago in Old Faithful, somebody had to use bear spray on a grizzly bear. So anytime you're in grizzly country and you're out of your car, it's good to have it. It's a really good idea. A rentable defense that could save lives. In Gardner, Haley Monaco, MTN News.